In the heart of Shaanxi Province, China, an ancient mystery lay buried beneath the Earth's crust for over 2,000 years. In the year 1974, a group of unsuspecting farmers were about to unearth one of the most significant archaeological discoveries of our time while digging a well. They stumbled upon fragments of terracotta figures, revealing a secret that had been hidden for centuries. The Terracotta Army, the immortal warriors of ancient China. These warriors are no ordinary soldiers. They are a collection of life-sized statues representing the Imperial Guard Troops of Emperor Qin Shi Huang, the first emperor of China. These figures, dating back to approximately the late 3rd century BCE, were intricately crafted to accompany the emperor in his afterlife, a testament to the emperor's ambition and the grandeur of his reign. Each statue is unique meticulously sculpted to represent an individual soldier. They vary in height, uniform, and hairstyle according to their roles. There are infantrymen, archers, cavalrymen, and charioteers, each one a silent sentinel standing guard over their emperor's tomb. A fascinating display of ancient Chinese craftsmanship, these figures are much more than clay and pigment. These soldiers were arranged in battle formations, ready to defend their emperor against any threats in the afterlife. This silent army, made of clay and baked in kiln, was designed to be as formidable as the real one. The detail on each figure is remarkable, from the intricate folds on the uniforms to the expressions etched on their faces, the level of craftsmanship is unparalleled. The Terracotta Army is believed to have been created by local craftsmen and possibly by the government's own workers. Each figure was constructed in parts. The legs, arms, torsos, and heads were created separately and then assembled. After the assembly, the clay figures were fired in a kiln and then painted, imbuing these warriors with life. The scale of the Terracotta Army is truly staggering. Current estimates suggest there may be over 8,000 soldiers, 130 chariots with 520 horses, and 150 cavalry horses. However, the majority remain buried, silently waiting to be discovered by future excavations. The Terracotta Army was discovered approximately 1.5 kilometers east of the tomb of Emperor Qin Shi Huang. It's part of a much larger necropolis, a microcosm of the Emperor's imperial palace and court. The tomb itself is yet to be fully excavated due to concerns about preservation of its contents. According to historical records, it contains a replica of the universe complete with rivers of mercury and gem-encrusted ceilings depicting the cosmos. The Terracotta Army is not just a display of Qin Shi Huang's power, but also a symbol of his revolutionary role in Chinese history. Before Qin Shi Huang, China was fragmented into several warring states. His military conquests unified these states, leading to the establishment of the Qin Dynasty and the birth of a unified China. His reign, although marked by brutality and despotism, brought about standardized weights, measures, currency, and writing, laying the groundwork for the nation we know today. Qin Shi Huang's reign was marked by monumental projects such as the Great Wall of China and his mausoleum guarded by the Terracotta Army. The construction of these grand projects required an astonishing amount of resources and manpower. It's estimated that hundreds of thousands of craftsmen, laborers, and convicts were conscripted to work on the emperor's mausoleum alone. Many of these laborers never left the project, their bones interred with the very edifice they were compelled to construct. The grandeur of the terracotta army and the tomb it guards stand in stark contrast to the harsh realities of Qin Shi Huang's rule. His obsession with immortality drove him to commission the construction of this elaborate mausoleum and its terracotta guardians. It's also believed that this pursuit of eternal life led him to consume mercury pills, ironically hastening his death. The discovery of the terracotta army in the late 20th century revolutionized our understanding of ancient China. 
The site has been a hotbed of archaeological activity, with teams working diligently to extract and restore the warriors piece by piece. Every new warrior unearthed adds a new piece to the complex puzzle of Emperor Qin Shi Huang's life and reign, shedding more light on the rich history of ancient China. Despite being over 2,000 years old, many of the terracotta figures are incredibly well preserved. However, once exposed to the air, the vivid colors that originally adorned the warriors fade rapidly due to the oxidation of the organic compounds in the pigment. This has been a significant challenge for the conservationists working at the site and has led to the development of various innovative preservation techniques. The Terracotta Army is more than just an archaeological treasure. It's a testament to a time when a single man's ambition shaped the destiny of a nation. It's a window into the past, offering glimpses of ancient warfare, society, art, and religion. This silent army is a monument to human creativity and labor, and a sobering reminder of the human cost of immortality. To this day, the Terracotta Army continues to fascinate and inspire. Millions of people from around the world flock to this archaeological site each year, captivated by the sight of these silent warriors standing guard over an emperor long gone. Exhibitions of the warriors have toured globally, bringing a piece of ancient China to audiences worldwide. Yet the Terracotta Army still guards many secrets. The unexcavated portions of Emperor Qin Shi Huang's mausoleum continue to beckon archaeologists, promising further discoveries waiting to be unearthed. Who knows what future excavations may reveal about this immortal army and the enigmatic emperor they were sworn to protect. As the sun sets over the silent figures of the Terracotta Army, we're reminded that each statue is not just a piece of terracotta, it's a soldier, a person, a life immortalized in clay. And as we continue to explore, to uncover, and to understand, we keep these silent sentinels in their history alive, echoing their story into the future. The Terracotta Army is a timeless testament to the power and grandeur of the first Emperor of China, Qin Shi Huang. It is a representation of his vision of the afterlife, his quest for immortality, and his indelible impact on Chinese history. Each meticulously crafted figure stands as a silent sentinel, a poignant reminder of a once mighty empire, and a man whose ambition knew no bounds. Over the years, this remarkable archaeological find has captivated scholars, historians, and tourists alike. It has inspired countless research papers, documentaries, and exhibitions, sparking worldwide interest in China's ancient past. It's a cultural treasure that connects us with a civilization that flourished over two millennia ago, illuminating our understanding of human history. Despite the wealth of knowledge we've gained from the Terracotta Army, it's clear that we've only just scratched the surface. Each unexcavated pit at the site, each still-buried figure, holds the potential to reveal more about Qin Shi Huang's reign, ancient Chinese society, and the remarkable technological capabilities of the craftsmen who created this immortal army. The Terracotta Army is a symbol of the immense human capability to create and to endure. Crafted by the hands of thousands of unnamed artisans, these figures have withstood the ravages of time, silently bearing witness to the rise and fall of dynasties, the evolution of societies, and the relentless march of history. The legacy of the Terracotta Army extends far beyond the boundaries of the archaeological site. It has found its way into popular culture, serving as a source of inspiration for artists filmmakers, writers, and designers. It has shaped the way we perceive ancient China, influencing our understanding of its history, culture, and people. In the end, the Terracotta Army is more than just a collection of clay figures buried in the ground. It's a reflection of who we are as a species, our desires, our fears, our capacity for greatness, and our propensity for destruction. It's a stark reminder of the transience of power, 
and the enduring nature of human ingenuity. As we continue to explore the mysteries of the Terracotta Army, we are participating in a dialogue that spans thousands of years. We are connecting with our ancestors, learning from their experiences, and carrying their legacy forward. In preserving and studying the Terracotta Army, we are not only honoring the past, but we are also shaping the future. And so, as the sun sets over the silent figures of the Terracotta Army, their story is far from over. As the guardians of an emperor long past, they continue their eternal vigil, bearing silent witness to the passage of time. Through them, the spirit of an ancient civilization lives on, its voice echoing through the ages, reminding us of our shared heritage and our journey as a human race.